Hello ladies and gentlemen, what is up guys? My name is Griff, welcome back to the channel. Today, uh, I graduated yesterday, but today we're going to get some new games. And here's my tassel guys for 2019. Alright, 2019. And here, ooh. I keep feeling like it keeps breaking, but really it's not. And then here's my high school diploma. <coughs> so, yeah. Alrighty. So, now let's go ahead and talk about the newest games that I am going to be bringing to this channel. There's going to be two games. Both of them are um, mostly positive on their reviews. Uh, all reviews are very positive on both. Uh, one of them's an early access game, one of them's not. Okay. And we're not going to be playing American Truck Simulator, however, we will be getting the DLCs for them. We're going to be getting a mega freaking update to this channel. Um, however, it's not going to be like screen recorders. No, I didn't get that much money. But. I did get enough money to get a few new games and DLCs. So, and Robux! So, and gas money and responsible money too, guys. I am responsible. Believe me, I have to get gas tomorrow. Because tomorrow is when I get these games. But, Depraved and Prison Architect are the two games that we are going to be getting. Um... However, I have to research more on Depraved. My dad just wants to play it. And I'm going like, um... Yeah, there's a lot to this. And it's, a, it's an early access game. So, you know, they're charging that much for this game. It might as well be a full product. It might as well be. But the thing is, is that it ain't no early. Alrighty, so... I'm probably going to get it before it drags up to probably 60. And, um, there is its first DLC, Depraved Soundtrack, plus name and game. So, it does not make sense. So, anyways, so, and Depraved is, I'm going to read the description. And Depraved is a set of builder game with survival aspects, held in the Wild West. Build towns, establish important outposts to supply your residents with food and other raw materials. Resist the seasons, dangerous animals, and bandits to conquer the Wild West. That's basically that. And this dude named Evil Bite is the developer and publisher. So he did a freaking heck of a job on it. I mean, very good graphics, um, very great everything. Prison Architects. Let's go ahead and talk that, about that. Alright, so basically, you're running a prison. Crap, I can't do my cricket voices anymore. But anyways, that's okay. So, basically, in prison architect, you're building a prison. Just kidding. There's a lot more to this game than just building prison. You have to worry about hospitals. You have to worry about, like, everything. But here's a description. Build and manage a maximum a security prison. That's basically the description. And this game is 30 bucks. So they're going to cost me around 60 bucks. This uh, Depraved is $24.99. And Prison Architect is $29.99. So they're going to cost me a good 30 bucks. Or so. So I'm basically going to get 60 bucks and pay for both of those. And then, having some American Truck Simulator DLCs, Washington is coming out, so I'm also going to be adding a little bit more money for that. Um, I heard that a new truck came out. I'm just not sure what new truck is because that, I think it was Western Star, but that's just the mod that came off of them. So I really hope they add that into the game, like a new truck, because they freaking had Volvivo. Okay, Volvivo was when you needed Origin in Arizona. 
get this. Now you need a new one because now you have Washington. So I think it's safe to say that they freaking need to add another freaking truck to it. And while Vivo didn't offer much of anything, um, like with Kenworth and Peterbilt, um, like they only gave us like two designs. With Peterbilt and Kenworth, heck no, they freaking gave us like four to five different designs, you know, of trucks. Just saying, so, you know, and we need some old trucks in here. I mean, come on, man, this is supposed to be a thing, and I would like to show off some of my trucks. Some of my trucks freaking are sharp, guys, like, they are freaking sharp. But, um, yeah, so, the new two games are Prison Architect and Depraved, and we will be playing some more American Truck Simulator with Orton and Washington. When Washington does come out, that's when I'm basically going to buy it, guys. Um... But don't worry, I've been keeping my eye on it. Right now, for all the DLCs, it's going to cost me about 40 bucks. Or, not 40, 50. 50 bucks. But here's the thing. For me, it's 40 bucks. Even with Washington. So, because I've already bought some of the DLCs, I bought two of the DLCs. And some of the DLCs, like the Dragon DLC, I don't even want that, man. Like, it has two paint jobs and one steering wheel creation. I'm going like, you know what? They need to update that DLC to freaking make it look boss. But, yeah, so, I'm probably going to restart on American Truck Simulator when I do that, guys. And, like, give everyone new trucks. However, my company is very successful. I own every garage. I own everything. So, I think it's time to get a new profile and show some challenges. <laughs> but, um, anyways, yeah. So, we're going to be getting those two. But, in Prison Protect, um, I did see it with my dad. And, um, he... he had uh, showed that it ain't no simple one. You have to worry about power, water, uh, riding, blood on the floor, you know, whatever. Whatever you can think about whatever's in a prison, pretty much. So it's the real deal. Um, and people have it very positive results. Hopefully it's not as hard like, okay, this is what a real electrician would do, you know. Um, but, yeah, so you have to deal with it. But... And this is also multiplayer. So, um, and I did see like a bit of the multiplayer one, and they basically help you build and maintain the facility. That's basically what they do. So, anyways, guys, I have graduated. All right, I've graduated, and it's time to go get breakfast.